So we are driving this 1976 Rolls-Royce Corniche drop head coupe. Uh, she was ordered new uh, by Max of Switzerland in Scottsdale, Arizona, and then purchased by, I believe his name, it was Michael Dale. And he lived or had a home here in Scottsdale as well. Yeah, he lived in New York, but had a, a home in uh, Scottsdale. Yes. For he and Gertrude. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so. And by the way, Max of Switzerland was the Rolls Royce, the authorized Rolls Royce and Bentley dealer in uh, Scottsdale. And Max is a client and a friend of ours. So, yeah, Max is kind of a local legend here when it comes he, to Rolls and Bentley. Yes, 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 yeah. Yeah, so this Rolls Royce uh, was ordered. Um, the color combination is really beautiful. It's it's the original color combination. Uh, she's enjoyed a repaint, but it is the it's, yeah the silver mink and Seychelles blue. Yes, so then, with uh, silver mink uh, striping. Yeah, and the wood is kind of, it's a nice light wood, so it gives it a really just a nice, fresh, handsome quality. And the wood is actually uh, quite nice, a couple of little cracks, but uh, overall it's in, in, there's some delamination over here of the, the varnish, or, uh, but not, I mean, the, wood, the wood itself is, is quite nice. Yeah, you can tell she was really taken care of. I think um, what I think he, uh, he only put what like thirty eight hundred miles on it. Well, yeah. So the the uh, first thirteen years, because right. it, it, Scottsdale was a second home essentially from from their New York home. In thirteen years, he had accumulated only thirty eight hundred miles on the car. Um, and now it's an incredibly low 32,000 miles from new. The um, original MSRP sticker was almost $68,000, which I, I found quite interesting considering Well, the for age. 1976, yeah. that was a lot. That was a lot of basically money. a house. Yeah. Depending on where you were. Yeah. And I, I love the, so the, the back seat is original and the front seats have been redone. Um, the, uh, importantly, the, the last owner uh, acquired the car 25 years ago and um, they were RROC members um, and uh, the, that's the Greenwo Greenwoods from Waterbury, Connecticut. Mm -hmm. And in 2018, I, I only have service receipts for 2018 and 2019, um, but they had um, J.E. Robinson uh, service, which, you know, that's John Robinson, uh, who's, you know, one of the top technical advisors for the club. He's definitely one of the, you know, U.S. experts for Rolls and Bentley, um, but they did... 28,000, we have the receipts we have from 2018 and 19 were $28,000 in restoration work, um, including the front seats, rebuilding the front seats with new leather and, and such, uh, air conditioning, hydraulics, etc. So all of that, again, on a 32,000 mile, uh, very few owner car. Mm -hmm. Well, and, and for me, my experience with this Corniche right now is it's she's really smooth and powerful, and it, it, it's just striking how smooth she drives. Yeah, the suspension was really advanced, um, and this you know this really shows mm -hmm. how advanced they were. Well, anyway, thank you very much, Carrie. Great oh, job. Thank you. My pleasure. As always, super fun. Yep. All right. See you on the road. Bye bye. So we've been driving some time uh, in and uh, idling as well, uh, and it's you know almost a hundred degrees. Great oil pressure. The temp is fantastic. Fuel gauge seems to work fine. She's charging fine. Uh, really, the the car the car seems uh, like you know she's a, a you know a nice car. A very nice example.
so it really, really feels nice. The ride quality is excellent for sure.